So we really wanted people today to reflect on their development, so reflect on what's been important for them while they've been working with Clark, um, what they've learned, how they've worked with other people, whether that be other researchers or NHS staff, NHS organisations. And we thought the best way of doing that would be to have um, some open discussions um, to get people to think creatively by bringing along an object um, to describe what their learning has been over the past however many years they've worked with Clark. When you explore your learning through metaphor, you get to places that you might not get to if you're talking in the language of a report, say, or um, an academic paper. So it's to get people thinking outside of, of that. So during Clark I've had to kind of um, merge these two new identities of a, a mother and also a PhD student and I sort of see the world through my child's eyes now for better or for worse and as I'm trying to convey the results of my PhD it's, it's dawned on me um, to use this particular toy as a way to explain um, general practice and the different types of appointments that are on offer and what I hear from a lot of patients is that they don't feel like they fit into the kind of very rigid rules of the practices and um, before my daughter learned to put these in she would just take the lid off and she'd put the pieces that needed to go in in there and I thought well, what if we just took the lid off and we didn't have such rigid rules and people could just be connected with the service they need I have brought um, this little Oscar statue because um, I've worked at Clark for quite a short period of time, for about seven or eight months, and um, when I first started Clark, this is the first project I worked on, it's called Oscars, and it's all to do with uh, stroke survivors and their carers, and um, basically improving the lives of carers of stroke survivors. Um, and I really enjoyed working on this project, I got to do quite a lot of patient engagement, um, and ad admin support, you don't always get to be sort of on the front line, so it was really nice to be able to uh, speak to stroke survivors and carers all about their stories and experiences as well. So I've brought some Play-Doh um, with the idea that this represents um, me over my time with Clark, um, in the sense that before Clark I spent a lot of time um, quite insular on my own, working on projects. With Clark, I've really had to mould myself and, and adapt to the types of teams I'm working with um, and the professionals that I'm speaking to. And you can hear that in the room right now, people understanding each other um, a bit better. So by the end, what they'll have is some personal reflection, a collective sense of what the learning's been, and also some personal next steps to enable them to move forward from today. I'm very keen on collaboration, that's one of the things I really love about Clark, uh, but seeing everyone else and all the other teams mention it and, and, and talk about the positiveness of, or the benefits of collaboration made me realise that I'm, I shouldn't be as, as cautious at approaching people to collaborate, which in the, in the past I've kind of been because I thought, you know, why would they want to collaborate with me, etc. But it, it seems like everyone's kind of bought into that.